This battle is about to explode. Fight! I started off. <laughs> So, this is my show, damn it. Word around the couch is Puma is back into the NBA shoe Back in the back in business. Back in business. Basketball making shoes. Ooh. After 20 years. Has it really been 20 years? Since I'm the reading class came 20 out. years. Yeah, <laughs> reading on the go, eh? Puma shoe that Puma's making is called the uh, Clyde Disrupt. Terrible name. It's. We'll give you thoughts on the shoes it's when, when it comes out. Yeah. It's a take on the classic. On the classic Puma Clyde. It looks like a Puma Clyde with the knit that most basketball shoes have now. And now, they are back. But more importantly, they got some young young superstars endorsing their brand. Like, three, three lottery picks. Marvin Bagley, Michael Porter, and DeAndre Aiden. DeAndre Aiden? Yeah, they got number one and number two, bro. Right. Representing Puma. And number uh, 14. You're gonna be rocking them ugly shoes. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> These shoes Hold up, no, crazy. save it for the review when it actually comes uh, out. Yeah. Puma? Puma's back, yo. They're it trying is. they're making waves, they're exciting, uh they got Jay Z. Jay Z is the thing. J What's the head? Yo, young Hove? I don't know. It just, mm. Yo, he's not a businessman. He's a businessman. <laughs> I don't understand this Jay Z thing. No, I know that's so weird. They they released like the the Rockefeller Air Forces like yeah. earlier this year, and he's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the bag, right? Yes, keep getting them checks. I know Puma Puma's be handing out the money. I don't know. I want to see what like current NBA star is gonna sign with them. Puma. Let's see PJ Tucker rock some Pumas. PJ Tucker, bro. I'm pretty sure he'll rock some Pumas. Apparently yeah. he bought like 20 grand of shoes. I mean, it's PJ Tucker. Probably, probably more than that. I think I read that right. It's probably like 100 grand worth of basketball shoes. I don't know, dog. Puma, Puma's trying to take over, dog. They were like, oh shoot, Adidas did it. Maybe we could do it. That is true. Like they put out, like their their lifestyle's popping, yo. Shout out to the Thunder. I don't even know the name of it. Thunder. It's lit, though. They're making mad colorways of they it. They are, but. They're doing They're gonna oversaturate the market. Yeah, what? Then it's gonna they're, be lame. they're doing it with the that's that's good though maybe maybe puma doing this will kill the dachu movement i'm tired of the dachu let's move on already damn hot take dachu movement's over he said it i thought it was gonna be done by this summer but it's still going Yo, on you can't be rocking dachus in the summer bro it's too hot i don't want to wear like that's... bulky leather when can you wear you can't wear it in winter time yeah you can't wear it in yes. spring it's like not that hot you wear it in the fall I guess. Yeah, wear your skinny jeans and your big shoes. Out here looking like a clown, you know? Can't look like that. Shout out to Ronald McDonald. Puma, let us know if you're rocking some Pumas. We will definitely, Aaron doesn't even hoop, but I will definitely not be wearing some Puma Clyde's on the court. That's a broken ankle uh, waiting to happen. Yep. So, that uh, shoe doesn't. Puma though. Puma's doing <laughs> some things. Yeah, Puma's doing, Puma's putting work, yo. I think they're filling in the gap of like, I don't know, like Asics had their run. Yeah. Salcony had their run. I uh, guess Puma wants their shine right now. And we missed the Clyde, but not for ball. You can't be wearing that for ball. Pumas, you're not really known for. Yeah. Shouts to Puma Clyde. Shouts to Swains. Peace out. Yep.